I make maps. I'm a modern day cartographer. Uh, maps nowadays is just more than the line on a map. It's the data behind the, the lines, the points. It's one thing to map a tree on a map, but you can actually like uh, get into the data. You can identify the tree, see what the species is, the diameter, the last time it was uh, inspected, and then you can derive information from the data. You can see what trends are. And uh, with, this, with the city, there's so many different things that the city uh, is interested in knowing what it is, where it is, what condition it is in. Uh, in public works, in utilities, we use it a ton. The maintenance guys are always documenting the, the different maintenance they do, the last time they flushed that hydrant, the last time they repaired that catch basin. You can identify the structure and, and have a good sense of the maintenance that has been done with, on it and when it might be due for maintenance. The data behind the maps are constantly being updated. We have a new map called the Golden Map, which you can turn on and off all these different GIS layers and explore the data for yourself. We also have single focus maps where if, you, if you're just interested in what park facilities there are, there's a park map where you can open it up, click on pickleball and see where all the pickleball courts are in the city. And it will filter them in the map as well as on a list. You can see what else is at the park. We also have something just as simple as, what is my recycling zone? You can open up the recycling zone map, put in your address, and it'll tell you where, whether you're in a blue or gray zone, and you can pull up the schedule and see if this is your week to get recycling pickup. We have elections coming up soon, so you can click on polling places, see where all the polling places are. Uh, different layers are updated in different, maybe, uh, Due to a development, one area really gets focused on and updated, whereas another area might not get updated. On Wednesday, November 20th, we are hosting an open house. It is from 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. upstairs City Hall in the Council Conference Room. I'm, I will have some posters and displays, uh, some uh, you can ask me any questions you have about our GIS. I can show you how how to access GIS on our city's website, answer any questions you have. We'll have some freebies and uh, coloring pages for the kids. For more city stories, check out ccxmedia.org or find us on social media.